Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Show and Tell by Southern Bell, the auction preview show where I give you a glimpse of some of the fun and fabulous items that will be sold at both the Saturday and Sunday auctions. So hopefully you have subscribed, you have turned the notifications on so that you will get a notification 30 minutes before the auction starts. Also, if you are a member of my Discord, we post about it there first and we ping everybody when the auction is starting. So that will also be a great notification. But if for some reason you can't attend the auction, you can always leave me an absentee bid or go ahead and make an offer I can't resist to me in the comments or via email. And then you save me the time of having to put it up on the auction block at all. So, this will not be all of the items that I'm selling Saturday and Sunday, because there just wouldn't be time to show them all. But this will be some of the highlighted items and the Bell's Bargain Bonanza round, which is at the beginning, the middle, and the end, is kept secret. Because those items start at the low price of $1, and we lower our regular $1 bidding increments down to only 50 cents for those rounds. So without further ado, laissez bon temps rouler. Let the good times roll. And we'll let the good times roll with these containers. Now, I had somebody who asked me about these during the last auction, but I'm starting the Bell's Bargain Bonanza round, and I was going to show them after that, because you can't stop a Bell's Bargain Bonanza to show regular items. But unfortunately, um, the person who asked about it couldn't stay. So I told her I will start the next auction with these and I'm starting the next auction preview with these technically. Um, but I will have these either at the Saturday or Sunday auction and hopefully I can figure it out with her. That's if somebody doesn't outbid her first. So look at these gorgeous clear containers and they have a super sweet motif. When else in canisters have you seen these cute girly lip designs? So whether you use them in the kitchen for your flour, your sugar, your coffee, or you use them in the bathroom for your cotton balls and um, scrunchies, Q-tips, and whatnot, these are going to be gorgeous and not the same old, same old that your grandma had. If you prefer canisters that you can write on and label, here they are. And they even have the uh, top to them that's more old fashioned rather than the glass top. If you're looking for a more farmhouse type feel. If that size was just too big for you, I do have a smaller size. How about a set of glass jars with glass tops? That'll be available too. Saturday and Sunday at 7 p.m. Central Standard Time. Who needs some fabulous new ceramic mugs? I've got a six-piece set. You get two of each type in here, and they hold 12 ounces of liquid. Great way to um, bring spring into your life. Once you get those mugs, where are you going to put them? Some of y'all may have room in your cabinets, but I've also got a mug holder that you can affix to your wall, and then people can just grab a mug off the holder. Of course, you could use this to hang your keys, hang your mittens, hang coats. The possibilities are endless. Electronics were popular last week. I have this three-in-one charging stand that holds an iPhone, an Apple Watch, AirPods, or Air Pro. So for you Apple Watch lovers, I've got a scrunchy band for an Apple Watch, or also for an Apple Watch, I have a, a band that is a beautiful aqua color. Um, in case y'all need a new spring band for your Apple Watches to keep them updated and current with the season. Who needs a Type-C USB power bank or an electric pencil sharpener? 
do you have too many cords in your life and you're worried about tripping over them or maybe one of your sweet little pets tripping over them or maybe even a child tripping over them? Do you realize you need to be more neat and organized for safety and yet you're not quite sure how? Well, I've got these cable and cord organizers in several different color and a cord wraps. So I might be able to provide the solution you need at a low affordable rate since this is the Southern Bell Channel. Need some huge, massive, heavy duty scissors for a craft project or maybe your kitchen? Who couldn't use some new sharp scissors? Because even in your kitchen, you've got to keep changing them out for health and safety reasons. And my mother always told me that crafting dulls scissors quickly, especially for paper. So she always had scissors that were labeled paper only, fabric only, food only. So sometimes you just need new scissors. Are you a person that can take the plain and mundane and make it into something spectacular? I have these star-shaped boxes. Imagine giving a gift in this, but think of all the ways that you could paint it, that you could decoupage it, that you could cover it with stickers or bejewel it. This could become a masterpiece. What Fabergé was to eggs, I would love for some of my ballerinas or ballerinos to make out of these cardboard star-shaped boxes. It's got a great shape. It's super sturdy, it is brand new in plastic, and you can make this your work of art. Whether you keep your keepsakes in it, whether you give gifts in it, or whether it is just an art project. Remember when games didn't mean video games or electronic games? What do you do when the power goes out? What do you do when you're stuck on an airplane or kids are in the back seat or you're just sitting at your office waiting for that next call to come in or waiting for the meeting to start? I've got this fun coin toss game and you get a set up too. Wish that things appeared brighter at night? I have these as seen on TV so they can explain it better than I can. And since you're seeing it in the preview video, you have time to watch the details where it says that these are night view glasses and it turns night into bright. You be the judge. I can offer it much more affordably than they can on the infomercials. Also as seen on TV, the Posture Doctor, which claims to be quick and easy posture corrector. You can relieve neck, back, and shoulder strains. And it's copper infused. I want to show you the most elite and fancy journal that I've ever seen. This one is called a Liquid Galaxy Journal. And it says to let your imagination flow. I'm not sure if you can see in here, but there is, maybe you can see kind of a movement and a glow um, in it, this is how it is liquid in here, and you can probably see the little glitter move around in it. It also comes with a lot of stuff. Let me show you in the back everything that it comes with. We'll go through all the specifics during the auction, but this is the most deluxe set that I've ever seen between the markers, the sheets, the stickers, the gel pens, glue sticks, cut out shapes, art shapes, and not only stickers, but rolls of stickers. I wanna show you this fabulous batter bowl. It is absolutely huge. It is a gorgeous red color. It has a handle so it's not spinning around when you're trying to stir, you can hold it steady. And best of all, it has a spout so that it all pours out at the right place so you're not getting a splatter on your counter. Not only that, but I've got these brand new tongs that are silicone coated that will match this bowl. But if that's not your favorite color, 
Then I also have them in a lovely aqua. And look, one side is completely um, solid. One side will let you have some breathable air or will let it drain and strain. We're getting closer to the end of the school year. So who needs a cute gift for teacher to thank her for all of her hard work with your children, your grandchildren, or students in general? Or maybe it's close to Teacher's Appreciation Day. Here's a cute little decor piece that she can put on her desk, her file cabinet, somewhere in her room to show how beloved she is by a student or students. Next, I have some kind of cute little organizational device. According to the label, it's a stacking organizer, and it looks like it's supposed to be for buttons or beading of some type. Um, so this will be available as well for those of y'all who are trying to get better organized. Who needs child safety latches for either your kids or maybe when the grandkids come over so that they can't accidentally get into the drawer where you have the knives or you have the skewers or you have any of those other implements so necessary for kitchen but yet so necessary to keep away from little hands. It is never too soon to start teaching kids at home or to do fun educational activities on the weekend. I've even seen some parents that when children need some kind of punishment that instead of making them boringly sit in the corner, which doesn't really serve a purpose, finds ways to make it a positive experience where it's not just writing, I will not leave the door open or I will not walk outside without permission a hundred times. Instead, they use that time for education, whether it is writing out multiplication tables, whether it is um, looking up vocabulary words, learning to spell 20 new words, where they find an educational opportunity for that time when they're in a time out. So you might could even use these note cards and for an educational opportunity as a means of positive correction. Last weekend, a few of the ladies in the chat got to talking about birthday parties that they were getting ready to host. I'm not sure if it was for children or grandchildren, adults, teens, or kids, but I wanted to show a few birthday items. I've got birthday candles. Uh, one is just a number three. One is both a, pardon me, happy birthday sign and a number four, so it's a two-piece set. Then I've got elegant silver and gold candles, which would be gorgeous for adults or for teens that have a glam sensibility. And then, funny of all, I've got the expensive magic birthday candles where they have that trick element where you think that you're blowing them out, but yet they spring back to life again and again and again. Super funny with adults, with senior citizens, even with that kid that knows it all and thinks they know what to expect, but doesn't when you use the magic birthday candles. Sometimes it's fun to put on a happy birthday headband or just for the guest of honor to wear that queen for a day or king for a day crown to feel special. Gotten some requests for more interior decor. So for all of my farmhouse lovers, I've got this great sign that specifies your kitchen is a farmhouse kitchen where happiness is homemade to teach the kids some geography or do you just need to show we are here and grandma and grandpa are there or we are here and where should we go on vacation in order to teach distance i've got this great map that's also a blackboard so you can write on it you can draw you can calculate distance you could even use it to teach them where the states are the state capitals, so much learning could come from this blackboard. The idea of a blackboard, but yet you don't need the outline of the United States. You just want to be able to write what you want to write on it, whether it's the daily menu for this week, 
Maybe it's a schedule. Maybe it's welcome or instructions to leave your shoes by the door or pick up your towels or whatever cute welcoming statements you have or whatever reminders for the spouse, kids, or grandkids. The sky's the limit as to what you can write on it. And you could change it out daily, weekly, or monthly with it being a blackboard. Brand new sealed in the package. If you need a different size, I also have one that's longer and thinner as well. And if you prefer for it to be up and down rather than side to side, you could hang it either way. There's a cute sign that says gather. Great to let people know that this is where to gather. Whether it's in your foyer, whether it's in your dining room, maybe even your kitchen, the possibilities are endless. But I'm going to end on this note because I would like for you to gather Saturday and Sunday at 7 p.m. Central Standard Time at Bargains by Bell, the Southern Bell auction for our great bargains. And don't forget, we will have three Bell's Bargain Bonanza rounds at the beginning, the middle, and the end. Those bargain bonanza rounds start at the low starting bid of $1 and we lower the $1 bidding increments down to only 50 cents. I hope to see you there. Don't forget to leave me some thumbs up. Leave me some great comments about your favorite items. If you need to leave absentee bids, please, oh please, go ahead and do that. And if you need to make me an offer I can't refuse, in case you think you're going to miss it at auction, you can absolutely do that too. So see y'all Saturday and Sunday. Laissez bon temps rouler. Let the good times roll. Roll in your life. Roll in your heart. Roll in your soul. Roll on and on and on. May God bless you. Bye-bye.